What's going on guys? My name is Rob. Welcome back into the channel. I just got the question how to add a new EOS account to Scatter. So I'm just going to quickly run through how to do that. So let's go ahead and go on up to Scatter. Now this is for an EOS account. So you already have your public key and private key attached to an EOS account. This is how you attach that EOS account to Scatter. So first, what you want to do is open your scatter, of course, and come to Key Pairs. And in Key Pairs, click New. Um, here you want to make sure you're on the EOS net, so EOS should be selected. This is just a name for your own viewing, uh, just so you can remember it easily. I always put in the name of the account that I am putting in, so this EOS account is send EOS to CML so it just makes it easy to remember what key this is attached to and here you input the private key that is attached to the account you want to import into scatter so I am going to go ahead and import my key and that automatically once you import the private key that automatically pulls up the public key associated with the account then you just click save now from here go back now you need to attach that key pair you just put in attach it to a scatter identity so you come up to identities on scatter click new here is the new identity EOS mainnet is what you want and here you select the key pair that you want to ta attach to this identity so I want send EOS to CML the key pair I just imported here send EOS to CML click you can come down and uh, input your first name last name email date of birth and stuff add your location if you want your phone number address everything if you want that is not required so select your key pair you want for me it's send EOS to CML the one I just imported into scatter click import and then select send EOS to CML active you want the active and use selected account then come up here and click save and there you go now I have a scatter identity with the send EOS to CML active key attached to it so now I can use this account with scatter on any dApp that uses scatter so there it is simple and easy to use all you have to do is first import the key pair for the EOS account you want to import into scatter and then attach that key pair to an identity so one key pair two identity click save on both of them you're ready to use that EOS account with scatter that's it for this quick video guys just wanted to clear it up for those who had the question if you do have any further questions leave them in the chat below and if you enjoy these quick tutorial videos, please make sure to drop a like on it. It goes a long way to helping out the channel and keep me going. And if you're not subscribed already and you do like these EOS videos, make sure to subscribe and click on that notification bell because we got many more EOS videos com coming your way. But that's going to do it for me for this one. I'll see you guys in the next one. And as always, stay living that crypto money life.